dedication to that special one Your love, your love, girl Yeah, 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 yeah. Of, uh, The album The World Must Listen is uh, resistance as well as just positive vibes It is a positive album in the sense that it's talking about things that humanity can do to, can do to make the world a better place It's also an album that is fighting against all those things that human beings are doing that are making the world waste and making survival harder than it should be. Okay, so this album is talking about uh, all these good things that human beings can do such as sharing with the lesser privileged as well as taking care of the environment in order to ensure that we are not destroying the earth. It's also talking about how we can still keep a positive vibe and a positive attitude despite all these bad things and uh, all these unfortunate circumstances that we are going through. Um, I love reggae music mainly because of uh, the general the general concept of reggae when you consider its history, uh, the roots of reggae music, it's rooted in uh, resistance against all negative forces negative systems it has a positive message because it's talking about the way we can keep a positive attitude even through struggles it's a type of music where you can feel it it's not just the lyrics or the music you don't hear it you actually feel it because it has that vibration you know that positive vibration that just uplifts you yeah and that's why i really really like it that's why i really really love it uh, the reggae artist that I really admire the most is Bob Marley, mainly because he's uh, the reggae artist that really brought reggae music to the rest of the world. And uh, I really admire his resilience because he had to fight many battles for him to succeed and to make reggae popular even in places where it was not known way back. And I also like his lyrics because his music is very spiritual. It's a type of music that you can really connect with. He really spoke from his heart. The other reggae artist that I really admire is Alpha Blondie because he also has a very positive message and he has this energy, you know, he has this energy when he's performing on stage. You can really tell that he really means what he says. And despite his circumstances and where he grew up, he had to face a lot of resistance when he was starting his music, but he still had to fight. And that really inspires me and uh, makes me to admire him a lot as an African reggae artist. The other reggae artist that I really admire, who is much younger than the other ones, who is more like our contemporary, is uh, Chronix. I like him because of his style. He's really gifted and uh, he really knows how to write music. His music is his music is so catchy that even people who don't really listen to reggae music really like it. Yes, and that's why I really really like his music. Really really. Amazing. 